Hey everyone, it's Brandon from Virtual DJ here with the tip of the day. Now, Virtual DJ features an advanced auto mix function which allows you to get out from behind your laptop to engage the audience instead of having to worry about manually mixing each song back to back. The auto mix function pulls tracks from the auto mix pane in the side view area. Click on this button to show the auto mix pane. Now, browse your folders or search for tracks to add using the search bar. Drag and drop each track that you wish to the auto mix pane. You can add multiple files at once by using OS keyboard shortcuts Command, Control, or Shift plus click to select multiple files, then drag to the auto mix pane. You can also load a saved playlist from the playlist folder. Once you have added some tracks to the auto mix pane, click on the auto mix engage button in the title bar area to start the auto mix. Virtual DJ will now load the first and second tracks into a free deck, or if one deck is already playing, will load the first track into the currently playing deck to be mixed next. Each track's waveform display will be shown along with white markers indicating mix-in and mix-out points. You can also rearrange the track order by dragging a track up or down in the list. To exit Auto Mix, click on the Auto Mix Engage button again. You can change the general Auto Mix type or style of mixing Virtual DJ will use in the Auto Mix Options menu. Show the Auto Mix Options menu by clicking on this button, then hover over Auto Mix Type and then select which Auto Mix type that you wish. The default option is Smart, which means Virtual DJ will determine which is the best type of mix based upon the upcoming track and, if the BPMs are within range, Virtual DJ will try to beat mix them together. The Fade Remove intro outro option attempts to remove dead air on both the intro and outro segments of the track. The fade remove silence option keeps the entire track from beginning to end while removing any dead air or silence that may be present in the track. The fade remove nothing option keeps the entire track from beginning to end and creates a crossfade point based on the selected auto mix length. The fade out cut in remove silence fades out the outgoing track and brings in the incoming track at full volume similar to how music is transitioned on the radio. And finally, the none back to back option is a simple cut mix that plays the files from complete start to finish, including any air gaps that may be present at the beginning or end. Additionally, all of the fade type options transition lengths are controlled by the auto mix length option, and it's only available when a fade option is selected. Other options available from the menu include clearing the auto mix, shuffling options, removing already played tracks, and to remove any duplicate tracks from the list. For even more custom control on how every song will mix together, you can open the auto mix editor to pre-listen and change each mix to whatever you wish. Compared to the competition, Virtual DJ's auto mix abilities are hands down the best in the business and give you the freedom to step away from your laptop and have more fun at your gigs. That'll do it for this tip of the day. We hope you found it helpful. Till the next one, remember, read your operation manuals. You'll never know what treasures of information you'll find until you do.